Hi everybody. Okay, so tonight I am actually gonna make <clears throat> chicken pot pie in our Tupperware Micro Pro grill. That's right. So I actually have to start it off a little bit, um, do some prep work before um, I went on live. So what I did was I actually cooked um, chicken. So this is um, chicken breasts. I think this is one and a half pounds of chicken breasts. And what I did was I put it in our small um, smart multi cooker. So what I steamed it, and I also steamed it as you can see, it came out not too long ago. So I steamed my um, veggies, and all it does was frozen vegetables. I got the mixed vegetables with the carrots, corn, peas, green beans. Um, I did that, and it was um, I think it was with the one, the bigger bag. So. I got that and then I got one and a half pounds of chicken which is at the bottom so now what we're gonna do let me flip this over so I can take this out and put it in here so this is the chicken and I just cut up the chicken um, in smaller pieces so they cook a little bit faster and I just seasoned it with garlic um, garlic salt and pepper and now what I'm gonna do is shred up the chicken and I'm gonna do that in our our chef so let me take the guard off the blade and we're gonna get the chicken and I am gonna, I don't know how much chicken I can do at one time. So let me see. The chicken is really soft too. So I had cooked this in the microwave, steamed it in the microwave actually for 15 minutes. I think I can shred it all one time. So I steamed it for 15 minutes and then I let it, um, maybe I shouldn't do it all one time. I don't want to break my thing. I let it rest for five minutes. Let me do this. And it actually was a little bit longer because I couldn't get this Facebook Live going. Oh, it was driving me crazy. Okay, so this is our power chef. And what this is, is a manual food, process, food processor. So I'm gonna shred the chicken. Oh, I can put all of it in here. Let me shred this chicken, and then um, we're gonna mix the chicken and the vegetables together. filling for the the pot pie okay so like I said we steamed the chicken and now we're gonna shred this for all the chicken and the vegetables. Oh, it shredded it pretty good. I think next time I'll just do half and half. Half um, and then do the other half after. Okay, so that's that was a uh, one and a half pounds of chicken. And then we're gonna put, I think this is, I can't remember how big the bag was. It was a bigger bag of, um, I got the uh, frozen mixed vegetables. So we're gonna add all of that in here. So what I'm gonna make is chicken pot pie. Yum. I haven't had that in a long time. Let's mix all of that. See, so I'm just mixing it all up. Now we're gonna add a can of cream of chicken. And this is our Tupperware can opener. 
the last can opener. I always say it every time I do my demos and I'm using the can opener. I always say this is the last can opener you're going to buy. And it is. Um, my husband and I would go through can openers like crazy. It just doesn't last long. So this is what this can opener does is it doesn't cut the can. It's actually releasing the factory seal. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to lift up the top and you pull right off. So no sharp edges. Your kids, my granddaughter does this with me um, when I go and visit her when she cooks with me, either during the summer here or when I go and visit her in Vegas. We do cooking. She just, and she can do this. I don't have to worry about her um, getting cut from the can after she opens it up. So. And then what I'm gonna do is just add a little bit water um, to this, just a little bit. And then I already, um, you can add more seasoning. Like I said, I seasoned my chicken earlier. So I'm just gonna put in a little bit, um, a little bit more um, garlic salt. I like to use garlic salt instead of regular salt. So I'll add a little bit more garlic salt and more pepper. Just a little bit more pepper. Let me put a little bit water. Just a little bit, not too much. We don't need this watery. Okay, and then let me add some garlic salt. And some pepper. And let's just mix this together and that's it for the filling so that was really easy okay now what I'm gonna do is I am going to line my micro grill with um, pie crust so what this is this is our micro pro grill and right now this is retail valued at $199. And what it is, is a literally a grill that you can put in the microwave. So what Tupperware has done is they have created a grill that you can put in the microwave and how it works is it heats up just like a grill. It'll heat up to 400 degrees and there's receptor plates on the top and the bottom. And that's what's grilling your food. So it has two positions that you can cook it in. You can cook it in the casserole so that it sits on top of the grill itself. Or you can put it in grill position. So the grill position, you can make bacon. You can do bacon in here, crispy bacon. You can do, um, in the grill position, you can grill chicken. So you can marinate chicken. Right now, it's basically just me and my husband um, at home. We're like pretty much empty nesters. So I don't have to cook a lot of food. So this is perfect just for the two of us. So we can grill chicken, we can um, make hamburgers. So even the maize hamburgers, I know a lot of people like the maize hamburgers. I know my kids love the maize hamburgers. From frozen, you can put it in here and cook it in the microwave and you're done. Six minutes and you're done. So now let's line our um, micro propel with the pie crust. So I just went out and I bought pie crust. Pillsbury pie crust and this comes with two so you're gonna put one at the bottom and one at the top so we're gonna do the bottom one first so. Let's do this. and you know it's gonna hang over but what we're gonna do is we're gonna trim away the excess and uh oh why is this not working there it is and we're gonna push it up against the sides. Well, this one looks like it won't even hang over, which might be good. I don't have a lot to trim off. So let me just pinch these parts together. That was coming off. Okay. 
Make sure the sides come up. Hope you guys are having, I hope you guys had a good day today. Today was actually a nice day outside because I thought it was supposed to get, um, I thought we were supposed to get bad weather, but I guess not. Okay, so there you go. It's lined. Line, line, line. So now all we're going to do is pour the filling that I made earlier into here. Um, looking at some other people that made these and I know they were saying um, some made too much so it kind of kept the lid from pop um, sitting down right so I'm trying to be uh, conscious about that and make sure I don't overfill I don't want to overfill this okay I think this is good I might have a little bit extra filling but that's okay you can eat it with rice right well, my husband can eat it with rice. Okay, so I just filled it up. And now we're going to unroll the other one. And hopefully the other one is just as easy to unroll. It's easier, I mean, to unroll than the first one. Okay, so now we're just going to put this part on top. And let's just... Pinch the sides together and I'm just gonna I don't know if I want to trim it I think I might just leave it in there it'll cook we'll just have extra crust that's all right I don't mind that that's my favorite part is the, the crust don't you think right. okay and then let's just poke a couple of holes at the top with the knife these are our Tupperware knives. They come with the sheaths, which is awesome. So you can get three of these. They're on sale right now. And where's my other one? So you can get these three. And you know what? I just got three for it. I don't remember how much they are. I know they're on sale right now. So let's just score some lines at the top. Okay, and that should be good. So this is our casserole position. And what we're gonna do is put this in the microwave for nine minutes. Nine minutes, um, maybe I'll do 10, because it says nine to 12 minutes. I'll do 10. Okay, so it's been five minutes. We let it sit for five minutes. This is the first time I'm making pot pie like this. I'm excited. Oh my goodness. You know what, I might have to throw this back in for a little bit. But I got to show you because the part of the crust didn't cook. But look at that. That was nine minutes. Oh, no, ten minutes. So I think I'm going to stick it back in for a couple more minutes. Oops. I'm going to stick it back in for a couple more minutes um, just so I can make sure that that part of the um, pie crust cooks. So. If you are interested, I just want to thank you guys for watching. Um, I will post a picture um, after I cut into it and put it on a plate so you guys can see what it looks like. But um, I just want to thank you guys for watching. And if you are interested in that Micropro Grill, why spend the $199 on it when you can get it for free with just $39 down and start your own Tupperware business? Be a Tupperware consultant. I mean, even if you're not going to pursue it as a business opportunity. If you love Tupperware and you say, huh, my husband doesn't want me to spend plenty of money on Tupperware, da 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 da, da. Hey, get it at a discount. You get 25% off. Why not? And when you get samples, every time we get a brochure every month or when our catalog, a new catalog comes out every quarter, you get 35% off on your samples. So why not become a Tupperware consultant? Make some extra side money. I mean, who doesn't need extra side money? Planning a vacation. You got kids you got to put to school. College. I mean, why not, right? So if you're interested, 
comment below or you can private message me if you feel better just private messaging me that would be good too if you have my number you can call me or text me um, and we can get together and I can um, go into more detail if that's something you're looking at doing but like I said this week until Friday when you sign up to become a consultant a brand new consultant you can get the micro grill for free after Friday you're gonna be um, you'll be able to get a micro pro grill when you sign up but you have to pay $45 it's a $45 copay for that so why pay $45 when you can get it for free who doesn't love free I love free so let me know and um, you guys have a fabulous evening and um, I will try and do a breakfast um, maker tomorrow uh, maybe I'll make some um, I'll make an omelet it's really easy and it'll be done in the microwave in two minutes so you guys have a fantastic evening thanks for watching